আউজু বিল্লাহ শৈতমান রাজিম বিসমিল্লাহ রহমান রাহিম ওয়েলকাম টু মাই লেসন টু অফ দি সিং লেটার মিনিংস টুডে উইল বি ডিসকাসিং দি মিনিংস অফ দি লেটার বা নাও ওয়ান অফ দি মিনিং মেড ইউ অলরেডি প্রবলি নো ইজ উইজ উইথ উইচ ইজ ইউজ ইন দি সেন্স অফ বাই মিনিংস অফ এন্ড দিস ওয়ার্ড উইথ ইন উইচ ইজ ইন ইংলিশ ইট ক্যান বি ইউজ ইন ডিফারেন্ট ওয়েজ ইন দি আরবিক ল্যাঙ্গুয়েজ ফর এক্সাম্পল মা ক্যান মিনস অ্যালং উইথ or which is used in the case of accompany now now this is known already right so you can see this difference between the ba and ma in the following two sentences banaitu uh, baitan bitubi means i built a house with bricks this means i built a house by means of bricks and then if you look at this sentence banaitu baitan ma ahmad Uh, this would mean i built a house along with ahmad right this is accompaniment huh? not uh, by means of okay now another meaning of this letter ba that is already known like once again in, in the modern standard arabic is without now for this meaning usually uh, it is associated with some other letters uh, or words such as say bila uh, means simply without biduni Uh, this also means without but in the sense of excluding something and be ghairi this also means without but in the sense of other thing okay then uh then what i discovered uh, is something new uh, which is in line with my uh, theory of the shape based meaning of the arabic letters i discovered that um, b means with b means with is because the dot uh, is with the harakat the kasra the kasra is with the uh, dot so this is a visual representation of the meaning of with by this b amazing huh? isn't it and if you look at ba ba right which is without uh, the harakat uh, the, this time the dot is without any harakat so this has the meaning of ba now this is my discovery which i'm going to discuss today okay uh you can see the example of this ba which uh, can mean without uh, in this word abasan which means in vain abasan means in vain and uh, i you know my theory also that uh, each letter has a meaning and then this meaning in turn gives the meaning of the uh, word huh? so abasan this meaning that in vain this word uh, you can literally uh, think of amal bila samar that means a work without a result so sa has a meaning of result and ba here means bila and a means amal so so uh, this is a built in meaning for this word okay this meaning uh, not only applies to the normal words but what i have found is that it also applies to a uh, scientifically you know definition of different words for example the word bashar means human and uh, what i found is that this word once again you can think of this as an abbreviation uh, these letters have uh, separate meanings uh, for instance we can see the meaning as bila sha manzur means without hair visible okay so humans uh, human as an animal a definition that they are uh, without any visible hair because you may know this that mammals uh, basically are characterized by three things one is the presence of hair on the skin and the presence of mammary glands and three bones in the middle layer this is uh, the biological definition of mammals and of this you see the hair is very important for distinguishing uh, different kind of mammals and in case of humans we notice uh, humans are exceptionally exceptional Uh, in that they are mammals but they don't have a visible hair like all the other animals including apes or any other animal that you can think of every and every mammal has uh, hair so so this is the uh, biological definition basically of humans and you can understand there are creator uh, created humans uh, with the idea that they would need clothes you see because you don't have hair uh, for the protection of the skin all right so it's it's truly amazing if you think about the way the arabic letters uh, give the built in meaning 
for instance see this word bina which means bina means uh, in between or between right between and you can see that the dot of the bar is placed exactly between uh, this shape okay this shape this boat like shape uh, actually this boat like shape uh, is uh, uh, a part of a larger group of letters with this fixed symbol okay ba ta sa this fixed symbol this fixed symbol is present in ba ta and sa these three letters mainly and uh, see the arabic word for sabit which contains these three letters has the meaning of fixed amazing isn't it truly truly amazing and so because of this meaning which is related to something fixed uh, we see that the letter ba is found in many words uh, that characteristically uh, does not move or is fixed for instance house bait mabnan means a building bahr means sea and bar means uh, land so all this uh, doesn't move so and uh, I will be coming up with uh, many more videos like this, inshallah, in the future, explaining to you each of the meaning of the letters. And uh, if you like this uh, video, please uh, subscribe, leave a like, and make a comment and share. And uh, if you want more information, please uh, check out my books, which is available from the Google Play books. So uh, see you soon, inshallah. Until then, Allah Hafiz.